What is criminally overpriced? Human pharmaceuticals. My dog needed a collation medication that my vet specifically said was on the pricey side but recommended a pharmacy that she worked with. I called with prescription in hand, and they quoted $3,000 for a month's supply. Then the rep stated they accidentally read the cost for humans. Dog cost was actually $60. Same dosage, same pill count, but adding chicken flavor and putting a little dog on the label dropped the price 98 and Funerals Have you seen the price of lettuce in Canada? EpiPens in the US I mean, at least it's not something I need to use regularly, but those things are so expensive. I'm just trying to not die if I accidentally eat a peanut. Thankfully I found a much cheaper alternative, but they're hiking their prices now too. Edit due to questions I currently have an AVQ, but they are going up to $100 after this year as I was recently informed by my allergist. Inkjet cartridges. College books. Inhalers. I have a crappy high deductible plan and pay $220 a month for something I need to breathe. Edit for Symbicort. Im an oddball and albuterol doesn't work for me. Second edit my inhaler is that price until I reach my high deductible. I use the generic, but I thought it was easier saying Symbicort than typing out the generic name. If I use good RX, it doesn't apply to said high deductible. I appreciate everyone's suggestions. My husband needs rituximab infusions due to a rare kidney disease. They are $16,000 each. That's $16,000 per 4-hour infusion. And they aren't covered by our insurance. Ticket website service fees. Everything scalpers have gotten their hands on. Game stations, graphics cards, you name it. Airport food and drinks. $7 for a granola bar. $6.95 for water. $22 for beer. $17 for a chicken wrap. $9 for trail mix. It's criminal. Eyeglasses. Because of a blatant monopoly. Luxotica controls 80 of the major brands in the $28 billion global eyeglasses industry. Forbes. I know everybody is going to give better answers, but for the life of me, I cannot without why suitcases are so expensive. They're just plastic shells, a zip and some wheels, yet they sell for hundreds. Toner ink. Groceries and rent. Right now? Everything. Anything with the word wedding attached photographer, cake, etc. Starting next year in Connecticut electricity rates are going up 50. College in general. Tuition, books which they change each semester and shockingly are written by the teacher requiring that book, parking. Insulin. Mental health care. Rent. College. You picked a bad time to ask this, friend, because the answer is literally everything right now. Anyone Christmas shopping right now might notice how ridiculously expensive kids' toys are. Prescription drugs in the U.S. It's absolutely immoral that U.S. politicians don't do something to keep sick people from getting totally screwed. Fucking salads. Man it's so frustrating, sometimes I just want something light and it costs me more than six hamburgers. Medical bills even with insurance. Everything we need to live a decent life. Food. Water. Medicine. Dampons, pads, toiletries. Healthcare. A place to live. Feminine sanitary products. Or just products targeted towards women in general. Especially in the US, I never realized how much women there were paying for pads until I visited family there. Might as well use dollar bills as pads at this stage. My EpiPen, kinda can't really afford to keep getting them. I'll be screwed if I get stung up and I'm a landscaper. Edit thanks everyone for the info on how to find them for much cheaper. Very much appreciated. A lot of great info here. Members of Congress. Only the corporations and billionaires can afford them. Dot life in general. Insulin in the US. Beer at an event. Underwear. Los Angeles. Dying. It's so expensive to get out of the system. Health insurance that actually covers anything without $15,000, $20,000 in deductibles, copays, and insulin. CompTIA certification exams, especially if you fail and have to take the test again. Adobe software. Dampons, pads. Insulin. Imagine making SMTH that is essential for certain people to live just so it gets resold for the price of an eyeball. Frames. Water. 
In the USA, healthcare, education all levels, even extended hours of preschool in a public school cost half as much as the rent of a 2BR apt. Diapers should not be this expensive especially considering how often they're used. Being poor. Gestures around at everything. Diamonds. Night vision goggles. Sex s hardly ever on sale and there are never any two-for-one deals either. Glasses. Hell, I didn't choose to be blind as a short-sighted bat, why do I have to spend a fuckton on a thing that I literally need to function? This concept extends to meds and other indispensable things, but for the sake of the thread it's just glasses. Added I am not complaining about the actual price. I know there are more affordable shops, my beef is with the fact that I need glasses to see and I either have to pay or I can go fuck myself with braille. Disneyland Cable TV and Internet Still waiting for the new Comcast router I've been told I'm getting on three different occasions. Most things? We get what, maybe 30 cent raise every year, most even get less or none. While prices go up by far, far more on everything each year. Oh, your rent went from 1200 to 1500 Oh here's 30 cents extra per hour, enjoy oh, you want to eat pasta bolognese? Well, one kilogram of ground beef will be 12 euro please, I could get it for 6.50 euro per kilogram last year. We are getting infinitely fucked, salaries are not going up, but everything else is, and we don't react to it, at all. Getting into heaven if you're a Mormon. They charge 10 of all your money for your entire life. Every paycheck done never on sale or any discounts or BOGO or anything. Printer ink. 